Hello everyone, and I am here in Florida, and we are going to be doing a lot of fun schleck things. So let's go ahead and get started. I have brought some of my collection, and we are actually going to have an unboxing here. So I'm so excited to show you all this, and let's get to it. Okay, so I just got our girl out of there. So this is the Andalusian that came with Lily, but I hadn't opened her up yet. So there she is. Our paddocks are set up back here. So we have two Z paddocks back here. And is that her and this one? And then we have um, this paddock, which has both. So there's one paddock there. And then
Hello everybody and I am here in Florida and as you all know it is fall so it is not like super duper warm here it's like 70s high so um yeah but we are enjoying it and there's beautiful sunshine so have you guys ever when you've gone on vacation ordered your shellac to be delivered to your hotel or your resort or wherever you're staying have you ever done that I have and it is so much fun so this time I wanted to do that again but I did not order these to be delivered to the resort because I had had so many unboxing at home like so much stuff that I haven't unboxed at home so I decided to bring some of the things that I haven't opened at home here so I have brought this one which is like super duper exciting the pony agility set and as you all can see it comes with these cones and this and we're going to do this one later so and I also brought this one but I had to wrap her in bubble wrap so if you guys have seen me you know that I bought all of the sets I bought um, blossom and Lily, I'm not really sure. Oh, Lily's scooping poop right now. I brought Blossom and Lily, and I brought I bought um, Lisa and Storm. So I bought her, and then I bought um, I forget what this one's. Oh, Sarah and Mystery. Of course, I gave these guys all different names. So um. The only one left in that set is Hannah and Cayenne. So this is Hannah and Cayenne. We are going to unbox Hannah and Cayenne. Now, if you've noticed on my shellac models, their legs do not bend. And that's because I bought them before the new models came out. So this one is technically retired now. And so is this one and this one and so is Lily so we I did not know that they were going to make the new models but when I found out that they were going to make the new models I decided that I wanted to have the whole set of all four girls so I bought the Hannah and Cayenne from a different site but anyway we're going to be unboxing them and they are a retired model so this is my first model that I will be opening that's retired. So let's go ahead and get started. First, we need to take the bubble wrap off her. Okay, here we go. I just wrapped her with this to protect her while we were traveling in the car. But there she is. Oh my goodness. Okay, so. Hmm. Some cardboard right here. Let's see if we can take that off so we can see her a little bit better. Okay, cardboard's off. Oh, and isn't she adorable? Oh my goodness. So it's Hannah and Cayenne is their names from the Shellac website, I'm pretty sure. So it shows the little Hannah on this box, and then it shows our other friend, which I named this one Lily. I forgot. Oh, I think her Shellac name is Sophie. Sophia, and this is Lisa, I believe, and Sarah, but I named them Lauren, Maya, and Lily. So, I'm not sure if Hannah will get a new name or not, or if she'll stay with her name. But anyway, this is a gorgeous horse. I love her. She's a quarter horse, and she's got great hair texture right here, like detail. She's so cute. I just love the new shellac models when they're like still shiny. She's got these cute little red ribbons in her hair. She comes with a bridle similar to um, Lauren's, I believe, the one that came with Diablo. Just like that, which is named Storm on the thing, if you all were wondering. <laughs> these names are getting confusing. So, okay, let's see if I can unwrap some of this. Oh, she is in there good. So it's a red saddle, English, and she's got these cute, cute cowboy boots and a hat with the red trim. I love the red theme. And the little light blue is so pretty as well. 
So she is just really, really pretty. Okay, let's get her out. Okay, so on the back, let's go over this first. So it just shows how her hands grip her model. Oh, she's got four white feet. That is so cute. I love it. And then the other things that you can buy. www.hoistclub.com The number of the model. Shellac, the brand. And then um, sticker. I don't know what that sticker's about. And then on the bottom, I think it just has something in another language. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can open her. Yay, Hannah is free. Hi Hannah, it is so nice to meet you. <laughs> oh my goodness. So she's got some detail on this shirt and then her hair is so pretty. It's like 3D there, they did that. Let's go ahead and take this other piece of wire. They wrap these things with like a lot of wire. But you can go ahead and use this wire to make your horse buckles for your halters and your um, blankets if you make those. So that's what I do. I use this wire because it's free and it's shiny. And there we go. Okay. Now you're finally free and we can look at you. So that is Hannah. Oh, she's so cute. I bet she would look great with my western saddle. Oh my goodness, this red is so her. Look at that. Doesn't that red look good? I cannot wait to try that on since this is a quarter horse. So her tack set is adorable as well. Look at that cute red. So this one's darker. Some of them come with dark, some of them come with a light color. Let's go ahead and take the saddle off and the bridle. Okay, here's the bridle. Oh my goodness, look at her. So cute. This is a beautiful model. Okay, and then I'm just taking the cinch off. They have it like really tight. When it's new, they are so hard to get off. Here, I'm just, I had to bring it closer to me to take it off. There we go. Okay, wow. Isn't she gorgeous? She is. She's got her little ears pricked up. Oh, she is so pretty. So gorgeous. Okay, so something I like to do in my shellac models is I like to check their bellies to see where they're made. If you guys didn't know, they are made like all over the world. So, shellac. And this one is made in China. Which isn't that cool since we see like a lot of things that are made in China here. But some of them are made like in really cool places. Like I think one of them was made in Indone Indonesia and anyway, just all over the world. Like I have, I can't remember exactly, but I have one from like the Philippines. I don't know, they're made everywhere and it's just really cool to see where they were made. Um, 
So yeah, it just gives her information on her belly. And I like to look if they are shod or unshod. So for her, it looks like she does not have shoes on, which I'm pretty sure all the ones that came with these did not. Diablo may have, I think Diablo might have, I can't remember. But as you can see, this one is part of that set and she does not have shoes. But these are like way different, you can tell, but they still have some like same characteristics. So the ribbons in the hair and she is just so pretty. I cannot wait to play with her. She is amazing. So thank you all for joining me in this unboxing. We got this horse, saddle, and the bridle. She's kind of twisted. Go the horse, the saddle, and the bridle. And this little lady, Hannah. Aren't they adorable? And thank you all for watching this unboxing. Guys, I am back for our biggest unboxing yet. Yesterday, we unboxed these two, Hannah and this lovely horse, Cayenne. Today, we are going to be boxing the Pony Agility set. And I'm so excited because I have waited to unbox this for a long time. So I believe this is the training set. So let's look at this. Um, so we have the pony and this little ramp. Um, these two cones with little balls on top. The fence rack and all the fences. The um, gate. <laughs> Sorry, I lost the word <laughs> there. Um, two little jumps, like little jump stands with the pole on top so you can take those apart and use those. This little pony with um, its halter and lead rope. This little girl and her helmet. Um, this like um, curtain thing that you go through with the cones and all these little um, decorations on it. So that is what this set comes with. It shows you that here on the back. It shows you the halter, the stickers that you put on these things. Um, just the manual and then the little cups, the girl and her helmet and all the functions. She grips things and she like can move. And then um, these little um, flag decorations that you put on here um these cones and the little toppers that go on them the two ponies the ramp the two sticks that go over the jumps or you can use them on the ground as drawing poles eight fences like that one gate and this curtain so down here it shows if you get the whole set what it would look like and that is really big so that is if you get this one and then three other boxes so that you could have the whole entire set which i do not have but that looks really cool over here it shows some other functions that you can do with this like the jump with the cones um turning the ramp upside down and then the whole set from like an overview and the brand schlack and the number so let's go ahead and get started opening this it's from the farm world as well i forgot to mention
so you can see it. Okay, so each of these came with little slips, which I really like. I'll probably keep these slips so that if I travel with these, I could like have them, I don't know, slip them back in. Kind of hard to slip back in though. Oh, there we go. Okay, so like little slides. Um, so the curtain, I kind of thought it would be like rubbery, but it's like not. It's kind of, I mean kind of, but it's more like plasticky. It's just like not solid rubber, but it's definitely bendable, as you can see. And it's really smooth. And then here's where it attaches to the thing. And these things are really split. I didn't expect them. I kind of, you can see that they're split, but I kind of expected them to kind of stay more together. So that's really cool. Um, So I definitely recommend this set. It was very fun to unbox and I cannot wait to play with it. Hello everybody, it's my last day here in Florida for the fall. So it has been a great trip. And as you guys know, we have done some shellac unboxing. We unboxed this set. Ta-da! And we unboxed this set. So that was very fun and exciting, but now we are going to do a short little vacation barn tour of everything just to show you all. I thought you guys might like to see the sets in action. <laughs> so I have it set up a little bit. So over here we have this little girl, which I haven't named yet, and the little pony, which I haven't named yet. And they are about to go over this course they just did the jump and came through this little curtain here and went over this um, ramp. And now they are headed toward the last jump as their coach, who is actually the owner of this ranch, is watching them. Miss Rosa, who is currently still armless because I have not found her arm, but we will get that glued on. But she is watching them and just seeing how they do this um, obstacle course. And um, so yeah, that's what they're doing in the arena. Then over to the side, we have Lily, who is 
taking care of their new mare that they just bought at the horse cell. So we've got some fall decor over here, a pine cone and some pumpkins. And then we've got Lily who is taking care of the new mare who actually just got a new halter and blanket from the local feed store. I made it. <laughs> and it has these cute little front buckles and she is just rocking out her tack and she looks so adorable in it with her cute little flower and bead on her halter. So she is eating some grain that Lily just gave her and some of this nice rich alfalfa hay and some Granny Smith apples, which she is enjoying. And she has her little water thing over here and she can talk to the horses inside the barn, but currently all the ones that stay in the barn are being ridden. Then right beside Lily and this nice little fence, I mean barn paddock, the paddock beside the barn, we have these little arena setups and it looks like Lauren is just about to set up a new jump for when they finish this course. And right in here we have like a stable yard where it kind of makes a little triangle there and we have her riding on the other new horse, Cayenne. And they are just going for a little ride. And he looks so cute in his red tack. She's got her red shirt on, so they just look adorable together. And then right beside that, we have this little fence. And it looks like Maya is just about to give this little pony some carrots. So she is putting some carrots in his little feed thing. And we have this little bell of hay that she's munching on. And then she just got a new halter as well. It was kind of hard to make for this tiny little pony, but it looks so cute on her with her little green hairbands and her green halter. So she is enjoying that and she's coming over to eat some carrots. And then right in here, we have little stalls and just some tacking stuff in the loft and some other things. This is the lead rope that goes with the halter for this little pony. And then we've got the wheelbarrow over here and some pumpkins that are going to be placed around the stable for decoration. And we have everybody's favorite, Snowball, who is eating on his doggy kibble and he has his little toys on his cute little bed. So that is all that I brought for vacation. I'm excited to bring this back to my home and put it in our stable. So we have all these new little characters that we unboxed here coming and this new horse and her blanket. And so that is all. Thank you all for watching.